I'm going to try that. Um, anarchists. Security is everywhere. Um, I'm going to call my speaker's name, and I hope uh, I hope that everybody's close enough so that they can join me on the stage. I would like all of us to be up here at one time. I will then have, introduce everyone separately, but in order that I have them on my sheet, one of your speakers today, the first speaker, be my friend, Mr. T.J. Bonner. T.J. is president of the National Border Patrol Council. Rodriguez, yeah. Chairman of You Don't Speak For Me, huh? Yeah. Mr. Roger Hedgecock. We owe Roger Hedgecock and Fair a big debt of gratitude for organizing your Feet to the Fire event. It's very well done. Thank you, Roger. Mr. Roy Beck. Roy is president and founder of Numbers USA. Roy is a personal friend, and I'm very proud to say Roy is a personal hero of mine. My friend from Georgia, Martha Zollick. I'll take care. Mr. Terry Anderson. If you ain't mad as hell, Mr. You're not Terry mad Anderson. Yo, Terry, yo. Terry's also a personal friend of mine. Terry comes to see us in Atlanta. The only negative thing I can say about Terry is when he comes to my house, the man will not eat grits. <laughs> Mr. Bob Park. Bob runs an organization called Veterans for Secure Borders. Mr. Peter Gadiel. 9-11 Families for Secure America. My friend Lupe Moreno. Where are you, Lupe? Latino Americans for Immigration Reform. KC McAlpin here. Mr. KC McAlpin, ladies and gentlemen. He runs pro English. KC has some wild idea that English should be our official language. Mr. Dan Sheehy, my friend Dan Sheehy is here. He wrote a book called Fighting Immigration Anarchy. If you haven't read it, please do. Frosty Woolridge, another friend of mine. Mr. William Keen of Alley Pack. Mr. Rick Oldman. Rick works for California's for Populi Population Station. My friend Mark Edwards is here all the way from Nevada and or Wisconsin. Where is Mark? Mark Edwards runs the Wake Up America Foundation. So, these are our speakers. I cannot tell you what it means to me that you all came today. Please enjoy what you hear. Please go home and tell people there is nothing wrong or un-American about speaking up, about secure borders, an equal application of the law, and English as the official language.